Hello everyone, I'm Carson. In the previous videos, we explained in detail the capacity and size selection of industrial and commercial energy storage, introduced the working principles of battery cells and accessories, as well as our professional operation and maintenance management and cloud platform functions, and also answered questions of interest to fans. In today's video, we take a 215 kilowatt hour energy storage system as an example to explain what monitoring and management units and platforms are included in the industrial and commercial energy storage system. What we are showing you now is the battery part of the energy storage system. Each battery pack is equipped with A, B, M, U. B, M, U is the abbreviation of battery management unit. It is mainly responsible for monitoring the basic parameters of each battery cell in the battery pack, such as voltage, current temperature, etc. It has high precision sensors and data acquisition circuits, which can obtain accurate battery status information in real time. By analyzing and processing this information, it provides basic data support for the entire battery management system. Core features accurate monitoring to ensure data accuracy and timeliness. Real-time feedback enables the system to respond quickly to changes in battery status. In the entire energy storage system, BMU plays the role of slave control and is responsible for monitoring, collecting information, and feeding it back to BMS. Okay, now you are looking at the BMS section. BMS is the abbreviation of battery management system. As the core component of the energy storage system, its main task is to ensure the safe and efficient operation of the battery pack. We can think of it as the brain of the battery. Just like our human brain controls and coordinates various parts of the body, BMS also controls and coordinates various parts of the battery to ensure that they operate normally and efficiently. The following are several key functions of BMS. Ensure remote monitoring and alarm of the system. Data transmission is carried out through wireless networks and other means to transmit real-time data to the monitoring end. At the same time, fault detection and alarm information can be sent regularly according to the system settings. Battery protection. When the battery voltage, current, temperature, and other parameters exceed the safety range, an alarm is issued in time and measures are taken to protect the battery. SOC balancing. By controlling the discharge and charging between batteries, the SOC of all battery cells is kept consistent. Data collection and transmission. The battery operation data is transmitted to the energy management system, EMS, to provide a basis for subsequent energy optimization configuration. The BMU and BMS mentioned above are both monitoring and management systems for the battery part. When we integrate the inverter to form an all-in-one system, EMS will also be involved. Let's talk about EMS. EMS is the abbreviation of energy management system. On the one hand, the energy management system is directly responsible for the control strategy of the energy storage system, which affects the decay rate and cycle life of the batteries in the system, thus determining the economic efficiency of energy storage. On the other hand, it also monitors faults and anomalies in system operation, playing an important role in timely and rapid protection of equipment and ensuring safety. Its core capabilities are as follows, energy dispatching, rationally allocate the charging and discharging energy of the energy storage cabinet according to the supply and demand of the power grid. Peak valley arbitrage, charge during the low load period of the power grid and discharge during the peak load period to achieve optimal utilization of energy. Demand response, according to the dispatching instructions of the power grid, timely adjust the charging and discharging strategy of the energy storage cabinet and participate in the peak load regulation and frequency regulation of the power grid. In summary, the normal operation of the industrial and commercial energy storage system is inseparable from these three key monitoring, management and protection systems, including BMU, BMS, and EMS. The three systems work together to form an efficient and reliable energy management system, providing stable and sustainable energy support for the system. Their interaction enables the entire system to adapt to different operating conditions and energy requirements, ensuring the reliability and efficiency of the system operation. Okay, this is the end of our technical professional explanation for this issue. Let's look forward to more professional knowledge sharing in the next issue.